Hey everyone, welcome back. I am outside of CVS to grab some gels for the sales week of January 2nd through January 8th. Happy New Year. I hope everybody had a great weekend and a great holiday vacation in general, if you had a vacation. Um, one of my accounts has been getting the same like 15 to 20 CRTs for a while. I got those same ones ex this week, so I have something to work with. Um, my other two accounts, one, I only got the three instants, and the second one, I got the three instants and one extra CRT. So I'm still gonna do what I can do. There will be a Google Doc link down below if you guys are interested. Interested. So I'm gonna head into the store, go over all of my deals, and then I'll come back into the car and go over my final cost for everything. This week's Select Colgate is on sale for $3.99. Buy two, get a $3 extra buck. So I don't have my Colgate coupons. I didn't get them in the inserts that I purchased. So I'm gonna pick up two of them at $3.99. It's gonna bring me to $7.98. I have a $2 off of one digital, so it's gonna lead me to pay $5.98. Then after I pay that, I will get back the $3 extra buck, making it $2.98. And then after I cash out, I will submit my receipt to the coupons app for $2 back on the second one. It the both just 98 cents or like 49 cents each. And I am doing this deal because I do have an extra buck on this account that is expiring. So I'm gonna do this transaction by itself. This week Revlon is buy two, get a $5 extra buck or buy three, get a $7 extra buck. So I'm gonna pick up one of the Kiss Bombs priced at $5.79. I'm going to pick up one of the concealers priced at ten dollars and 79 cents and then i'm going to pick up an eyeliner priced at eight dollars and 69 cents these three products are going to bring me to 25 dollars and 27 cents i have a three dollar manufactured digital that is attaching to the kiss balm for the eye product i have a three dollar off one eye manufacturer coupon for the face product i have a four dollar off manufacturer face cosmetic coupon so that is a total of $10 in manufacturer coupons. I also have this $4 off any Revlon that printed for everybody at the Redbox machine this week. Then I have a $5 off any cosmetics that I got in a text message that I did send to my card. I'm hoping that full value will come off. I am going to do this deal by itself. And then I have a $3 off any cosmetic that printed for everybody last week. So together, if all of those come off, it'll take off $22 from the $25.27. I should pay $3.27, get back the $7 extra buck for buying three products, making it a $3.73 moneymaker for all three products. Now I'm gonna repeat the Revlon deal. It didn't work out exactly how I planned it to in the first transaction because sometimes when you have a lot of CRTs, um, some of them will drop on some time. So I'm gonna do this deal separately. It is gonna be a separate scenario. I'm gonna grab an eyeliner for $8.69. And then I'm also gonna grab a kiss bomb again for five dollars and 79 cents both of these are going to bring me to fourteen dollars and 48 cents i am going to use digital coupons i have a three dollar off the eye manufacturer digital three dollar off the lip manufacturer digital then i have another text for five dollars off a cosmetic and then i have a three dollar off any cosmetic from last week that totals fifteen dollars so i'm hoping they'll all come off and drop down to zero so I'll pay zero dollars and get back the five dollar extra buck for buying two, making it completely free and a five dollar extra buck. I think one of them will drop, but either way, it should still be a money maker. With those two Revlon products, I'm going to do the L'Oreal Elvive this week. They are two for eight dollars. You're not getting anything back, but everybody did get this two dollar off of two instant coupon at the Redbox machine this week. So I'm going to pick up two for eight dollars. I do. I do have the $2 off of two. I printed this $3 off of two from coupons.com yesterday, and I also clipped the three off of two on Sunday I or Saturday, I believe. So I should take off $8 if the $3 both come off together and make two of these completely free. Now I'm gonna do a big transaction. I got this 10 off of 70 at the bottom of my receipt last week. So I'm gonna do a deal. Hopefully I'll probably be over $70 because I think I'm gonna use a four off of 14 cosmetics also. But the first deal I'm gonna grab is on the You Buy Kotex. This week select You Buy Kotex pads, liners, or tampons are two for $8. Buy two, get a $2 extra buck. I'm gonna scan these at the red box. I do think that they're part of the promotion. So it's gonna bring me to $8. I do have this $4 off of two that I did clip from the coupons.com website yesterday. If you cannot print them, they were also in the one, two smart source inserts, I believe. I don't have the smart source, I only got the saves. So I'm gonna use a printable, printable coupon. I also have a four off of two digital that I'm hoping will come off. If both of those come off together, I will pay zero, get back the $2 extra buck for buying two, making them completely free and a $2 money maker. I was hoping to find some of the Summer's Eve cloths, the wipes for $3.89, but the store is all out of them. They do have these right here priced at $4.19. 
they are feminine care wipes and then they also have these right here for four dollars and 19 cents also the cheaper ones that i could find so i'm going to grab either these or those they both attach to these two dollar off feminine cleansing wipes or washes so four dollars will come off of the 419 and make them just 19 cents if you can find the summer's eve and you have double crts from last week and this week one of them will drop down to a dollar 89 and make these completely free since I am building my total up, I am just going to repeat the L Vive deal on this account. Again, they are two for eight. Everybody got the $2 off of two at the Redbox machine this week. I also have a $3 off of two digital that I'm hoping will come off of a $3 off of two that I printed from coupons.com. If all $8 come off, it'll make both of them completely free. I'm going to pair in some of this soft soap hand soap. It also includes the Irish Spring bar soap, the three count, but my store doesn't have any. So I'm going to pick up four of these for $10. When you buy four, you're going to get a $5 extra buck. I don't have any coupons. So after that, I'll pay $5 for four or $1.25 each. This week, Boost nutritional drinks are on a promotion for buy four, get a $10 extra buck. They're also on sale for $8.99. The High protein is on sale for $9.99. It is part of the deal. My store only has three of the originals, so I am gonna pick up three of those. And one of the high protein, it's gonna bring my subtotal to $36.96. I do have two $5 off of two manufacturer coupons that came out in yesterday's inserts. Then I also have a $5 off of two digital that I also clipped. So if all $15 come off the $36.96, I will pay $21.96, get back the $10 extra buck, making it $11.96 for all four or $2.99 each. Not the greatest deal, but it's still a pretty good deal to pair in since I do have that spend 70, save $10. I'm gonna grab two of the Suave Essentials Body Wash. They're priced at $2.19. Buy one, get one 50% off. Buy two, get a $2 extra buck. So one of them is gonna be $2.19 and the second one is gonna be $1.09. Both of them are gonna bring me to 328. I do have a dollar off of two digital coupons, so that's gonna come off, drop me down to 228. Then I will get that $2 extra buck for buying two. It's gonna make my final cost 28 cents for both or 14 cents each. These are the deals I'm gonna do in this transaction. It's the soft soap, the wipes, the U by Kotex, Elvive, Suave, and the Boost. I was gonna do the Suave in the first transaction, but I didn't have a small enough extra buck to cover the cost, so I just pushed it into this transaction. My subtotal here is $70.39. After coupons, I should pay $34.39. Then I will pair in that 10 off of 70, which is gonna drop me down to $24.39. Then I should get back $19 in extra bucks, making it $5.39 for all of this stuff. But I also have Revlon coupons and CRTs on this account. So I'm going to do this, do a transaction with that. And hopefully that'll be a moneymaker to help cover the cost and lower the $5.39 down. So it'll be cheaper final cost. So I'm going to do a Revlon deal again to help cover the cost of my last transaction. I'm going to pick up another Revlon Kiss Balm. This is priced at $5.79. And I'm also going to pick up another eyeliner priced at $8.69. Both of these are gonna bring me to $14.48. I do have separate coupons or different coupons for this transaction. I have the four off of any that printed for everybody at the red box, $3 off the lip digital, $3 off the eye paper coupon, and this four off of 14, that's a total of $14 from the $14.48. I will pay 48 cents, get back a $5 extra buck for buying two, making it a $4.52 moneymaker. I'm going to grab a micellar wipe. The Skin Active is priced at $7.59. This week it's buy to get a mask for free, but I'm only going to pick up one at $7.59. I have two of these $3 off Skin Active Facial Care CRTs that will attach and this $2 off of one manufacturer coupon that will also attach. So one of the CRTs will drop down and make them completely free. I'm gonna pick up these Gold Emblem Classic Blend Trail Mix. It's priced at $3.49. I have two of these $1.50 off Gold Emblem or Bound Nuts. It does say $3.99 or higher, but they do attach to the ones that are priced lower. So it'll take off $3 and make it just 49 cents. These folic acid tablets are buy one, get one free at $3.99. So I'm gonna pick up two and use this $4 off CVS Health Brand Vitamins. Since one of them is free, it'll take off the complete $3.99 and make two of them completely free. I do have my free beauty gift for December. It expires on the 17th, so I'm gonna go ahead and grab one of these right here. It is the Buffer, it's priced at $3.49. After I use that CRT, it'll make it completely free. This week, select Aquaphor and Eucerin, or spend 20, get a $10 extra buck. 
So I'm gonna grab this one right here, priced at $8.79. And then I'm gonna grab one of the Aquaphor ointment sprays, priced at $12.79. I did look on the website and both of these are part of the promotion. So both of these are gonna bring me to $21.58. We got this awesome coupon in yesterday's inserts. It's for $3 off any Userin body product and it does include the eight ounce. So I'm gonna use it on the Advanced Repair Cream. I have a $3 off for the Aquaphor ointment that did also come in yesterday's inserts and then I have a three off of ten body lotion or hand and body lotion that does attach to this one also so that'll take nine dollars off of the $21.58 I will pay $12.58 for both get back a ten dollar extra buck for spending 20 making it $2.58 for both of them so this is going to be my last transaction I have the gold emblem the Garnier the free December gift two of the uh, folic acid vitamins the aquaphor deal and the revlon i should pay about 13.55 and then get back a 15 dollars extra buck or 10 for the aquaphor and eucerin and five dollars for the revlon making it a small money maker so i made it back into the car from cvs i'm going to go ahead and go over all of my receipts and my final cost for everything so the first transaction i did was on two of the colgate toothpaste they are 3.99 um, this week buy two get a three dollar extra buck so i had the two dollar digital i did roll a six dollar extra buck because it was expiring tomorrow so i do need to use it um so i paid a zero subtotal i did get back my three dollar extra buck it does tell you right here um i just rolled it into my second transaction so i don't have you to to show it but i think i took a picture of it if i do i'll pop it right here on the screen so it cost me a 5.98 i got back the three 2.98 then i will submit my receipt to the coupons app for two dollars back it makes it two toothpaste 98 cents or 48 cents each i just used it to be able to get another extra buck and not let the full six dollars go to waste because i did try to use a extra buck expired one day here and it said it was invalid so i'm not trying to do that again so that transaction cost me 98 cents on my second transaction i did two of the l'oreal l vive and two of the Revlon products. This $3 coupon is for the L'Oreal L Vive. Then the $3 off of two came off also the digital. Then I had a $3 eye coupon and a $3 lip coupon for the Revlon. I had that $5 cosmetic CRT that did drop down to $2.79, so I lost $2.21 there. And sometimes that does happen because it comes off of the cheapest item after coupons. So there's a $3 off any cosmetic that did take off the full cost and the $2 off to L'Oreal hair. I didn't roll any extra bucks because I didn't know exactly how it was going to work out. If everything had came off like it was supposed to, I would have had um, a zero subtotal, I believe. So um, I did just pay $2.69 out of pocket, saved $21.77. I did get back the $5 for the Revlon and I also got a five off of 30 on this transaction or on this account which is awesome I'm gonna save that for next week I don't know how long it's gonna take for my CRTs to come back so that'll give me a little bit of extra savings next week so that first transaction I paid 269 got back a five dollar extra buck made it a 231 money maker and then I did do two more Revlon products by themselves which is right here yeah this is the right one so i picked up three of the revlon products i did the kiss balm a eyeliner and a concealer so this is three dollar off of the revlon four dollar off the revlon face three dollar off the revlon lip the three dollar manufacturer coupons and the inserts exclude the lip balm but the digital does attach then i had that five dollar cosmetic that also dropped down to 279 so i lost 221 there there is the four dollar off the revlon $3 off any cosmetic and then $3 extra buck that I did roll from the Colgate transaction. So I paid $2.48 out of pocket plus tax. I did use that on a Fetch Rewards gift card today, so I didn't pay anything on out of my transactions at all today. I saved $22.79, which is 90%, and I did get back this $7 extra buck for buying three of the Revlon products. So between extra bucks and what I paid out of pocket, I paid $5.48, got back seven. It makes this transaction completely free and a $1.52 moneymaker. Fingers cross that we get some Revlon rebates on Ibotta. I feel like usually when we get coupons and deals, the Revlon rebate usually pops up. Um, even if it's within seven days, you can still submit your receipts. And if it refreshes within seven days, you can submit all your receipts. So this is the um, spend or the save 10 off of a $7 purchase, which was my biggest one that I did today. There are the Ubi Kotex, the L5 L5. I did four of the soft soap hand soaps. This is boost 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 and i do believe that one of those was 9.99 so it does include those those are the ones the protein ones i believe and then the suave suave 
and then this is the feminine care wipes coupons two five dollar off of two boost four dollar off of i want to say that is a U by Kotex, $3 off of the L Vive, $5 off of two boosts glitched and came off, $4 off of two Kotex glitched and came off, $3 off of two L'Oreal glitched and came off, the dollar off of two Suave, my 10 off of 70, my $2 off Feminine, the $2 off um, Select L'Oreal. This $2 off Feminine dropped it down to $1.41, um, so I lost 59 cents there. Then I rolled a total of $24 in extra bucks into this transaction, and then I paid a dollar and two cents out of pocket. So I saved $86.03, which was 99%. I did get back $2 for the Suave, I'm guessing. It's for that one. The $5 for the Soft Soap. $2 for, what is this? No, that is for the Suave. So the other $2 is the you buy Kotex. And then the $10 down here is for the boost. So I got back a total of $19. I spent $25.02. So it makes this transaction $6.02. But I also got another 10 off of 70 that I can use in next week's transaction. So that's good. I'm happy with that. And then for my last transaction that I did was the Beauty 360 Buffer. The CVS Vitamins were buy one get one free so $3.99 one of them did ring up at zero and then the Garnier Micellar, Revlon, Revlon, Eucerin, Aquaphor and then the Goldabound Trail Mix $3 off of the Revlon, $2 off oh for the Garnier, $3 off of the Eucerin, $3 off of the Eucerin then $3 off Revlon Lip free beauty product took off the complete $3.49 the 4 off of 14 cosmetics four off of CVS vitamins, it took off $3.99 like it was supposed to, four dollar off the Revlon, a three dollar off the Garnier, three dollar off the Garnier, it took off only $2.18, so I lost 41 cents there, not too much and not that bad. Three dollar off of 10 handed body lotion, and then the dollar fifty and the dollar fifty off of the nuts, I rolled $13 in extra bucks and paid 96 cents plus tax on a Fetch Rewards gift card, saved $57.65, got back five for the Revlon and $10 for the Eucerin and Aquaphor, which is 15. I spent $13.96, got back 15. It makes this transaction right here a dollar and four cents. So everything all together that I picked up when I subtract what it cost me and my money makers, everything that I picked up today was $2.13. Um, I did lose a little bit of CRT money in some of my transactions. I was hoping it was going to be free, um, but $2.13 is still really good for everything that I grabbed today. I think or know for a fact that I saved at least $150. I do have to still calculate that and put it in the thumbnail. But yeah, Walgreens is right across the street, if you guys can see right there, but it is getting pretty dark already. It's already 5.45 in the afternoon and I still have to run to Walmart. So I think I'm going to go to Walgreens in the morning and have that video up tomorrow. Um, I'm not sure yet. I'll go to the light and see how I feel. But if I don't, I will post that video tomorrow. But thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.